Hey, how you guys doing today? I got a really good treat for you guys. Uh, we're coming to the end of Love and Marriage Huntsville season, so I wanted to give the reviewer awards. Um, I'll be giving this award in honor of Funky Dineva. Funky Dineva actually, um, we'll call it the Funky Dineva Awards, even though I haven't got uh, permission from Funky to uh, name it the Funky Dineva Awards, but um, Funky Dineva actually changed the trajectory of uh, Love and Marriage Huntsville. And his reviews were so on point, they were hilarious. Um, and we can see everything that he's done with his career after um, reviewing, because you know, you see him on television, you see him on radio, and he's always doing some really, you know, creative and, and insightful things. He's a really, really good person to, um, to model your career after. So everybody that's out here doing reviews, I wish them nothing but success um, and professionalism and also taking it to the next level. So in honor of Funky Dineva and the one who actually put Huntsville on the reviewing map, um, I wanna give this year's nominees. In the male category, we have uh, DJ Richie Sky, we have Kim Pyre, we have um, Rodney The Voice, um, Giving You The Real T, and Scotty By Nature. In the female category, we have um, It's Rocks, um, Ashley Miller, Jaylee's Corner, Misha I'm, IMO, um, Jamie That's Me, uh, Color Me Pink, Bondi Blue, uh, Empress Radio, Dana Rose, or Diana Rose, I don't know, um, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, Kia Simone Speaks, Niecy Dixon, Brown Skin Girl, Hey Girl Hey, Queen Sheba, uh, Da Silva, Silver, and Aunt Anne. Um, now, I've, I've actually um, qualified each one of these based on my own personal um, review of the reviewers. <laughs> And I have different categories as far as uh, top tier, um, objectivity, you know, hilarious, uh, humor, um, insight, wisdom, um, the ability to tell the difference between what's story and uh, what's reality, um, and those that think logically, those that are objective, those that um, those that bring insightful. Uh, viewpoints. So I'll tell you a little bit about what I like about each individual viewer. And then um, I'm going to give the awards to uh, these individuals. So they'll get the Funky Dineva Award. Um, number one, I'll start with Rodney the voice. First of all, his laughs and his rants are hilarious. Uh, with Kim Pyre, I love his objectivity, his professionalism, his insight and his humor. Um, and he has some real good shade and he has a nice good pause after he throws his shade to where it, he lets it sink in. Um, I love DJ Richie Sky. I love his ability to see the TV portion versus the reality portion. He doesn't get lost in the sauce and he's a genuinely positive guy um, and he's a good person with depth. Um, it's Rocks. Oh man, she's absolutely hilarious. Um, she has different characters and different voices. Uh, I love her wisdom. Um, I like the, the fact that she actually, she can get into her review because she's giving it from a personal perspective. Um, her jokes and her tone is extremely engaging. Um, Misha IMO, uh, I absolutely love her insight, her humor, her shade, her objectivity, her sayings, um, her intellect and wisdom. And when she says, listen, I'm talking to you, um, you probably should stop and listen because she's very, very insightful. Um, and she's extremely logical. Uh, Courtney and Eddie, that's a that's a couple team. Um, so they're gonna give you balance. They're, um, they're gonna give you humor. They're gonna give you objectivity. They're gonna give you real life. You get a chance to see things from a male perspective, from a female perspective. So I kind of like that that balance that they play off um, with each other. Sometimes Eddie gets a little um, too funny, 
but uh, she brings Coco brings them back around. Um, Ashley Miller, she's extremely funny. She is um, intuitive. And she has the best random stories about her life. Like she'll just, you know, she has some really, really engaging stories before she actually even gets into the review. Jay Lee's Corner, I really like her because she's uh, creative. She's excellent at, at working through story, um, giving you the real tea. I love his over the top foolishness. Um, he has lost a lot of his objectivity, but uh, his humor makes you tune in. Um, and beware because he also has a foul mouth. Uh, Scotty by nature, um, when he isn't screaming at us, he has some good insights. Uh, he's very funny at times. And when he goes off, he actually goes off. Uh, Jamie, that's me. Um, she's funny. She's insightful. Um, she's timely. And she makes you feel like you're right there when she's actually talking. Um, uh, Bondi Blue, she was another one that is like, uh, she's really, really creative. And I liked her versatility. Bondi can sing, she can, uh, she's engaging, she's funny. Um, Color Me Pink is a lot of the same thing. She's actually really, really funny. I like her, I really love her sense of humor. Not like, I love her sense of humor. And even when her jokes doesn't land, it's still funny because it's funny to her. Um, and she's really good with engaging with her fan base. Now, um, there's the other people, you know, I, I like the fact that they're, that they're doing their reviews and that they're actually out there trying and they're, they're, uh, engaged, but these are, these are people I think that can work on, um, they can work on some of their insight. They can work on some of their the ability to separate themselves from other reviewers because there's a lot of names that we just named, but how do you stick out in the crowd? And those individuals are Empress Radio, Dana Rose, uh, Diana Rose, uh, Kia Simone Speaks, Aunt Anne, De Silva Silver, Nisi Dixon, Brown Skin Girl, Hey Girl, Hey Queen Sheba. Um, I, I kind of got a little, um, I think I, I think uh, I got a little off when um as i'm watching i see people losing objectivity so um i think bondi blue kind of lost me a little bit I, she used to be you know in the top rotation um but she kind of lost me a little bit when she lost some of her objectivity um and color me pink actually uh lost me when she lost some of her objectivity but ultimately she lost me when she compared, uh, or she made a joke about Martel's wine and she called it Ines. I mean, his Ines wine, I'm sorry, called his Ines wine incest. And uh, I just think that it's offensive considering that it was named after his grandmother. And she's resting in peace. And it was to honor her name and her legacy. So at the very least, I think that we could be respectful with the name and give her the honor that she's due. So she kind of lost me with that. Um, but nevertheless, she's still good at what she does. Um, I'm sure that she'll uh, get it corrected for next year. Um, so to give you the top tier of reviewers for both men and women and couples, I would say Rodney The Voice, Kim Pyre, DJ Richie Sky, It's Rocks, uh, Misha I'm, IMO, um, Courtney and Eddie, Ashley Miller, Jay Lee's Corner, giving you the real tea, Scotty by nature, um, Jamie, that's me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Giving you the real tea. He also lost some of his obje objectivity as well. So I'm sorry. He's, he's not in there. Scotty by nature TV, um, and Jamie, that's me. So with no further ado, the couple reviewer of the year is Courtney and Eddie with Coed. Congratulations, you guys have won the Funky Dineva Award for reviewer, couples reviewer of the year uh, for LAMH. Um, no further ado, we'll, we'll go with ladies first. Um, this lady is, to me, one of my favorite reviewers 
Uh, behind Funky Dineva, she's really one of my favorite reviewers just because of the insight that she has. She's extremely, extremely funny. She, she knows how to cover all of the bases. And that award goes to Misha moving forward. <laughs> um, Misha, IMO, she's hilarious. If you haven't seen her, you need to go see her. She is absolutely hilarious. She has very, very good insight. And I just love her sayings. Um, and last but not least, this was a really tight race. But I'm going to have to go with DJ Richie Sky. DJ Richie Sky has been um, a fan of ours for a while. He's watched um, and he's watched us transition. Um, and I really like his insight. DJ Richie Sky is timely with his reviews. Um, and I really like his engagement. He gets fan engagement back and forth. He gets uh, reviewers um, and his fan base. Uh, he gets that engagement. He gets their feedback. Um, he gets a chance to see it from their viewpoint and he, he offers his viewpoint as well. Um, but I really like DJ Richie Sky and I like the fact that he sees the forest and the trees. You know, it's very difficult for some people to see beyond what's shown on television, um, to see why it was shown on television. And I really like the fact that he can actually see that as well. So, um, Congratulations to the Funky Dineva winners, uh, DJ Richie Sky, Misha, IMO, and Courtney and Eddie. Congratulations, 2023. Let's round it out and get ready for next season, guys. Everybody that I mentioned today, hopefully you'll be the one that gets the award next season.